Hey guys, Tommy B in NC. Um, this is for Danny Walker. I really appreciate you, Danny, giving me that telemetry module. I've got it all hooked up. As you see, no modules and junk on outside the quad. You know, it's all, you know, I don't have my Mobius on there or anything right now. But uh, I, I'm in safe mode. I always, you know, let it initialize and start up in safe mode to get GPS lock. I've gave it plenty of time for it to get its GPS signal. So far, so good. Okay, now here is the radio, and that's showing the GPS screen. That's voltage. That's uh, a split of voltage, altitude, and speed. Altitude and speed. Voltage. Flight log, which I, I, I eliminated because I don't have it's going to take up room on your SD card, and I, and I, and you got to have it running through a spectrum telemetry receiver. That you have to eliminate. And of course, that's back in my home screen. And this is the one that, that I have on when I'm flying, and it's giving me voice information of feet, which, uh, you know, altitude, speed, battery, etc. Okay, we're going to back out. You know, we're, we're close to, the, here, here's something people run into too. We're, we're standing here close to the quad. You're supposed to be 18 feet away from the quad within the safe circle, and the quad is on which, which this would be on the south side of my safe circle, and I'm standing and looking at the rear of quad. Okay, come on over here. Let's get some safe distance. Okay, Thomas, when I come up in the air, you put it over here where you can hear the volume on this. Okay. Okay, you hear it saying my flight pack is 12.4 volts. Okay, coming up off the ground. Okay, now what I'm going to do to start with, I'm going to come over here. And one, ap after I did this modification, I did compass calibration. And you see, it's flying out in a straight line from me. Now the wind caught me there. Um, but that's how you tell one needs compass, is if it don't fly straight out from you when you do that right there. If it drifts, it needs compass. Okay, now I'm going to go on up. And I want to say safe limit is 45 feet, I think. Now I'm bottomed out on throttle. Went a little bit more. And my actual height is it's showing 84 feet. It's showing 84 feet, I think. But you got to keep in mind, I don't think this is a real super accurate GPS because it's mean sea level. And um, it's probably not, you know, super dead accurate there. But as you can see, as you can see on my radio, all the functions are working. Where she can go in and set alarms and stuff. And I've, I've noticed it takes a little bit for it to catch back up whenever the quad moves. And I guess that's the information getting fed to the GPS. It's taken, you know, a couple of times of it announcing it before it gets caught back up on the information again. Okay, I'm going to head on out. All right, as you see right now, I'm bottomed out on throttle in safe. Okay, now what I'm going to do now, I'm, I'm going to come back over to me. And here I go. I'm going to go to AP mode. Okay, 
Okay, now I'm gonna come down, I'm gonna let my throttle down a little bit. I'm about centered out on my throttle. Okay, now here I go to stability. All right, now I gotta take control of it because I got a little bit of wind here today. All right, now Thomas, I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch the quad. You keep on the radio. Can you see height? Oh gosh, I'm up there too now. Altitude 217 feet. All right, see altitude too, and I'm up there, guys. I mean, I'm up there. T Thomas, sh show the quad. Got a little bit of wind today, so I'm having to kind of stay on the sticks. Right now I'm coming down. Thanks, Danny Walker. I got telemetry, man. It's cool. Thanks a lot.